In today's video, we play a game of Hoplite Battle Royale. Hoplite is a server that is owned by Speedsolver and includes a lot of the legendary items that you can see in his tournament videos. Now, as we played this intense game of Battle Royale, Speedsolver ended up spectating and watched what happened. So make sure to stay till the end to see what happens as well. And this game was crazy. And the game has begun, and we've got this big custom structure right here, which I'm going to go check out. Now, I should be minor kit, which means I can easily break through these blocks. Now, with that, I can get some very good chests. We've opened one chest, and we've already got ourselves a diamond, which is amazing. And we're just going to get so much candy, which is going to help us heal up later in the game. And there should be one more chest remaining in this structure, and here it is. And we got five gunpowder. Okay, that's interesting. Also just going to gather myself some mushrooms for a custom craft that we're going to make later in the game. Stick around to see what that is. And for this game, we're basically going to be going underground as quick as possible. And with that, we're going to see how many diamonds we can mine. Now this baby zombie isn't going to leave me alone. So I need to just run for quite a while. And there is another structure right here, but I'm going to guess this is like 100% looted. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, I want you to let me know in the comments how you found this video. And if you've already watched one of my previous videos, I want you to let me know what you thought of that video and what made you want to watch another one. Okay, new cave. Has it got anything to offer? So far, definite. Ooh, a mineshaft. Okay. Now, we like mineshafts because they have minecart chests. I'm literally obsessed with minecart chests. Like, there's nothing... More exciting than opening minecart chests in Hoplite, and that is why. I mean, they're not normally that good, but you can get so many cool things from minecart chests. Oh, yes, come on, not chapel. Oh, yes! Oh my god, yes! That's so good. I only have one diamond, though, so making Excalibur is kind of difficult. But yeah, we only need one diamond, so if we can manage to go back to where we were before and like, drop down into that cave... Maybe there's a chance. Or I can get another minecart chest that has a diamond inside, which is also possible. Oh, and someone just made Excalibur in the chat. That's insane. Well, good timing. All right, what am I going to do with all this candy? Like, it is a little ridiculous how much I've actually got. Because it's nearing Halloween, they've added candy to the server. And basically what it does is it heals you two hearts. And then on top of that, you also get a random potion effect which can be positive or negative. Someone just made emerald- oh, There's two players, what the hell? That is a little strange. That guy's got diamond boots as well. I'm not at zero zero and there's just two people chilling here that are already prepared for PvP. I've got a notch, so if I kill this guy in the notch and then kill the other guy, that would be great. Be two. This guy's gonna die a lot faster than he thought. He's already on 15. Oh, we got absorption. That's huge. It's basically just healed me up to full and gave me like an extra heart. Okay, I think this guy's ate like two guts. He had a chest plate the entire time, he was hiding it. Okay, I think I actually not it. I think it's worth it. This guy really crafted an axe. Yikes. They're actually fighting. This guy is saying so I'm not quick drop, bro. I guess he finds it disrespectful that I'm fighting him when he's half diamonds. But I've got enough healing to do it, and I've been winning a lot, so... I'm not saying you are a quick drop, but... You can't say you're not, if I'm beating you. And that other guy just got a kill. It's so weird how they've been very close together the entire time. And now he's, like, trying to run desperately to save his friend. Maybe. Okay, and he left the guy on 3 HP who has half diamonds. Very, very sus. Not gonna lie. Nice, we got him. And he also had extra diamonds. The guy's loot was really random. Okay, we got ourselves a diamond sword now. Uh, and we have diamonds for an E-table. So that was actually really perfect. 
Did he have any lapis? He did. Okay. A lot better than I thought it would be. Okay, we need to get ourselves a book. Okay, so the full line with the axe just said this NPC just feds over half diamonds. <laughs> he left him on 3 HP, so I don't know about that. Hey you! Have you ever logged onto your favourite Minecraft server and seen someone's cape and thought, wow, that is truly amazing? Most likely, it has been a Zova cape. So make sure to go check out my cosmetics in the description or type the link that is on the screen right now. If you buy anything, it will help me out massively and please do enjoy the rest of the video. Enchants are currently bugged and I believe it's like mending that sharpness. So this is protection. No, oh, it's projectile protection. I forgot. Oh my god, that's irritating. Mending. Oh my gosh, I've done it again. What am I doing, bro? <laughs> what am I doing? I literally just made the same mistake twice. It's actually okay, because if someone's both spamming us, we'll take less damage. And I'm half diamond anyway, which is going to be better than most people's armor. And when I kill someone with the same pieces that I've got right now, we can just use theirs. So, after all that complaining... It's actually not too much of a problem. Now, making a never react call right now is a good idea. I'm gonna try it. It's cool. With a skeleton, give me a with a skeleton skull. Oh, now what I'm gonna do is get myself some wood. And with that wood, I'm gonna make myself a bowl. And I'm gonna make very suspicious stew, like I said at the start of the game. Now, what this does is it basically gives me eight hearts of regeneration. And then on top of that, we get a random potion effect, just like the candy. And that guy said NPC just gave Zoba half diamond and he died to a trapper. I don't know why, but I'm kind of liking the fact that I've got projectile protection. It makes it feel like more competitive and stuff. Like if I was like prot 2, half prot 2, something about that is just boring. I want to take damage, have risky fights. I don't want to be like some tank after one kill. I've got one kill. Even though we've done all this fighting, we only got one kill. And it was definitely worth it because uh, we still haven't even made a G head. So, if I can get myself a few more kills before deathmatch, then I can craft myself some golden heads. And we also have the very suspicious stew. So, yeah, pretty good. Is this Fade God? It's not. It's the love games as absorption. You have diamond leggings. Yes, you do. You've also got speed and strength with Excalibur. That's not what I wanted to see. At all. I don't even think it was this guy that crafted Excalibur. So, the fact that he's made speed and strength and then he's got excalibur from a kill it makes him super super stacked this guy's like the most stacked you can be really it's two people in a cave right there oh <gasps> wait he's actually going away is this guy serious this could end up being the biggest clean of the game fade gods on nine hp Okay, we got him. There's got to be some good loot in here. There's just heads and everything everywhere. Make a sharpness two. And we could probably afford a sharpness three. Can I do it right now? Yeah, I can. Oh my god. Okay. Deathmatch counter just started. We are going to have a ridiculous amount of candy. That's one thing for sure. I need a bundle so bad. Okay, I'm going to have to make a bundle because of the sheer amount of stuff that I've actually got in my inventory. So what I'm going to do... Just start putting these candies in here, and we can basically have infinite healing with candy. So, what I should do straight away is just make these G heads because if I do get jumped now, I'm gonna die instantly because I don't have like any sort of instant health. So, I've just done that quickly. And of course, we know there is some more loot up here. I just do want to make sure I get like everything possible from this guy. Okay, 12 golds just chilling in there, black candles. Now, I need to organize this inventory because it is absolutely ridiculous. If I can somehow get a spider eye, that would be great because I can make agony, which is a weakness potion. And when this guy has this strong stuff, obviously that would be very good. Let's do two of these. Can I make one more? Nope. Okay, instant health two, that's four hearts. Jump boost. But yeah, when this guy has, like, very good loot, obviously we need to, like, risk 
making stuff like Aries Blessing to get more stacks. Because I could have got like diamond armor or anything from that. So we got all this candy. That's probably about like, what? Two times nine. Probably like 30 hearts worth of health right there. And then I've also got seven gaps, two G heads. The two extra heads would have been really useful. Someone just did that to me, I think. Okay, I don't have any lapis, unfortunately. This person is dropping Gerald's on me. I don't know who has those type of superpowers to be able to do that. I don't have any XP. Are you serious? Oh my gosh, we're broke. I made that sharp three and then we're cooked. Okay, here we go. The toughest death match is about to be played. I should probably eat some candies to try get absorption. That was probably a smart idea. Don't see anyone right now. We're gonna get diamonds from a chest, which is leggings. There we go. It's diamond leggings. This guy just used his Excalibur. I'm gonna leave him alone for a second so I can craft leggings. Not that I want to go and fight him. <laughs> this guy's got Ravager horn. Okay. If that Ravager dies, I need to remember that guy's name and try to kill him. I think he might have a katana as well, but I'm not tripping. It looked like he had a katana. Might be worth getting arrows, because if I get on Ravager, I could potentially bow the stat guy to death. Okay, what did we get from that? We got health boost. Okay, that's not bad. Then I can eat this. And get poisons. Sure, why not? Got speed three. Let's go. Can't let this guy- Oh! This guy's nicked with emerald sword. That's interesting. So, if that guy's nicked, he's probably quite a good player. Meaning, you can kind of leave him and he'll probably fight the other person. This guy's not going to be happy I stole this kill. It's probably like two hits from dying. One. Two. Nice. I need this Ravager horn. So, with this heads, I think it's worth making an Ares Blessing. I need like a Notch Apple or another G head or... Something to get, like, better armor. Golden apple. It works. So this guy also has his own Excalibur. Whoa! Two Excaliburs. Yikes. Well, I'll let them have a Excalibur off and they can fight each other. We're not really getting any good potion effects and I've used all these candies pretty quickly. It's like half the time it'll do damage to you, so it's like two or three candies to actually get to a heart sometimes. Worst place you could have placed a block. Really? Got the heads, that's all that matters. There's gold in there, but I'm gonna leave it. It could even be a stack, but I don't care. Let's just eat this. It kind of looks like that guy got the loot as well, since he got the kill, which is good for me. Got a power book from that. Power bow, even. Now, I'm gonna keep it as a regular head because we are gonna get low on healing very soon, I would imagine. Okay, so health boost is only for another minute and a half. So, I think I'm going to eat this gap. Does this guy still have potion effects? He doesn't. That's good for me. I can beat that guy in a 1v1, 100%. I think I just need to start fighting people to make this interesting. Okay, he's using Excalibur and he's going in. 
burn back into him. Just make him start fighting for a bit. This guy's got speed and strength once again. <laughs> Yikes. They both have Excalibur, just bear that in mind. Okay, he's getting low. Okay, they're fighting again, and this time I feel like it's going to be a lot longer. That sharpness 5 is just shredding. There's no way he dies. He's on 3! I don't know if it was smart for me to kill him there. We'll soon find out. The jump boost! The jump boost! You're not serious! You're not serious! The jump boost! <laughs> the jump boost into a web. Oh my god, he had 10 gaps. Sharp 2, knockback 1, Excalibur. What was the other one? Unbreaking 1. How about his Emerald Sword Sharpness 4, of course? And his armor? Pro 1, Pro 1. Nothing amazing. Oh my gosh, that was so good. We love that. So yeah, if you guys want to play games like this, make sure to join mc.hoplite.gg. And it turns out that it was Speed Silver trolling me.